Hey guys, a quick tip with Bluebeam is loading profiles. So I have Bluebeam 2018 open right now. Uh, up here on the menu heading, click review. If we drop this down, we get profiles and we get a little extension or a drop down. And it has a number of profiles that are kind of default on your your Bluebeam install. So we have review, review, advanced, quantity, takeoff. And most of these are oriented towards workflows and stuff or more or less look at them that way. So if you're doing a lot of quantity takeoff, it wouldn't hurt to check it out and see if it's a, you know, if it does make your process a little bit more efficient, then so be it, you know, uh, switch it to that profile as your default. And down here, I got a couple other ones, my review and my review uh, NOD. And these are uh, these are custom ones. I'll talk about how to create those. It, it's pretty easy. Um, I do say don't don't click down here because what that's going to do is update the profile that you're currently in. So if I'm in takeoff, it'll update it. Or if I'm in regular review and save the profile, it's going to update it. So ignore that. But if we want to simply switch to a different profile. All you got to do is click on it and it, turn, it makes it the active profile. Come back up here, you'll see that quantity takeoff is checked. If I want uh, something like advanced, click on it. It goes, the, the menu drops and the interface changes a little bit. So, this doesn't look very advanced though. What is it? Um, review advanced. That, so there's two different advanced ones. Um, yeah, you just open it up, drop down the list, and you can switch them pretty easily from there. So I hope this helps. Just a quick little tip. Uh, I'll do some more uh, with profiles later on. Thanks a lot.